All right, first step for the death rate in Alabama exceeding 10,000 today. This as a state crosses uh, that grim milestone and other states across the nation are considering easing restrictions on safer at home orders. But even as more vaccines are going into arms, health leaders warn against getting complacent, saying we still need to mask up wash hands and social distance. At this time, Alabama's current mask mandate is set to expire Friday. Governor Ivey hasn't said whether she's going to extend it, only saying an update is coming soon. Fox News investigative reporter Brendan Kirby is joining me now. And Brendan, you've been speaking with people in the community about how they feel about what should happen next. What are they saying? Well, Lenise, opinions are mixed and we found passion on both sides of the debate. Alabamians have been required to wear masks in public indoor places and outdoors in certain instances since the middle of July. Public health experts overwhelmingly support the measure and say it's too soon to return to normal in the fight against COVID-19. But pressure is growing on Governor Ivey to rip the masks off. This week, the governors of Texas and Mississippi repealed their ma mandatory mask orders, and the Alabama Policy Institute, a conservative think tank in Alabama, has called on the governor to lift the restriction. The governor will be making her decision at a time when COVID-19 cases and hospitalizations are plummeting and more people are getting vaccinated. But the state also just crossed the 10,000 death mark. Here on the Gulf Coast, there is no shortage of advice for the governor. Oh, lift it, completely lift it. I know that COVID's real. I've had it. I think there are some false stories about it, uh, but I do know it's real and I don't wish it on anyone. But I will say we have got to get back to real living. She need to keep it on. Okay, now come Just because we're still taking these shots up, everybody else can't take the shot right now because they got to be 65 and older. We, everybody still should continue with this mess right now. While Alabama has had a mask order for more than seven months, it hasn't really fared much better than some neighboring states that don't have mask mandates. And we'll have a closer look at this coming up at Fox 10 News at 5. Reporting live, Brendan Kirby, Fox 10 News.